Listening one. One. A bunch of us are going to get something to eat after class. How about coming with us? Two. I think it'll be too cold to go to the beach this weekend. How about going to the health club instead? It's got a great indoor pool. Three. Do you have any plans for Sunday? Why don't we check the movie theater website and see what's playing? Four. Do you want to go somewhere after class? Why don't we try that new cafe in your school? Five. Would you like to come to my place for dinner on Friday night? I've invited a few friends over. Six. Why don't we rent a DVD tomorrow night? There are some great new movies I'd like to see. Listening to. One. Listen, I've got some tickets for a great play on Sunday night. Are you free, Melanie? Sunday night? Yeah, I'm free. What kind of play is it? A musical. Oh, actually, I don't really like musicals. Thanks anyway. Some other time, maybe. Oh, sure. Two. There's a great new Mexican restaurant downtown. Would you like to try it, Jake? We could go there for dinner on Friday night. That sounds great. I love Mexican food. Maybe after dinner we could take a walk in the park. Yeah, I haven't been to the park in a long time, and it's supposed to be really nice out. Three. Are you doing anything tonight, Sarah? How about seeing a movie? A movie? I'd like to, but I'm really tired. Are you sure? There's a new French movie I'm dying to see. I really think I'd better stay home tonight. I've been out nearly every night this week. Maybe some other time? Sure. Four. I'm going to the park with some friends for a barbecue this weekend. That sounds fun. Would you like to come with us, Ben? We're going on Sunday afternoon. Sunday afternoon? I'd love to. Oh, wait. I just remembered. I'm going to a baseball game with my dad. He got the tickets a month ago. That sounds cool, too. Enjoy the game. Five. Do you like ice skating, Jen? I've never tried it. Then you have to try it. How about Thursday or Friday night? Thursday night is no good for me. I have a Spanish class. Is Friday night okay? Yes, it's fine. Terrific. You'll love it. Then after we finish, we can get something to eat downtown. Okay. Thanks. Six. Would you like to see a tennis match with me on Sunday afternoon, Stephen? Sunday? What am I doing on Sunday afternoon? That should be okay. I don't think I have any plans. Great. And maybe after the match, we could see a movie? Sounds good. Listening to. One. Listen, I've got some tickets for a great play on Sunday night. Are you free, Melanie? Sunday night? Yeah, I'm free. What kind of play is it? A musical. Oh, actually, I don't really like musicals. Thanks anyway. Some other time, maybe. Oh, sure. Two. There's a great new Mexican restaurant downtown. Would you like to try it, Jake? We could go there for dinner on Friday night. That sounds great. I love Mexican food. Maybe after dinner we could take a walk in the park. Yeah, I haven't been to the park in a long time. And it's supposed to be really nice out. Three. Are you doing anything tonight, Sarah? How about seeing a movie? A movie? I'd like to, but I'm really tired. Are you sure? There's a new French movie I'm dying to see. I really think I'd better stay home tonight. I've been out nearly every night this week. Maybe some other time? Sure. Four. I'm going to the park with some friends for a barbecue this weekend. That sounds fun. Would you like to come with us, Ben? We're going on Sunday afternoon.
Sunday afternoon? I'd love to. Oh, wait. I just remembered. I'm going to a baseball game with my dad. He got the tickets a month ago. That sounds cool, too. Enjoy the game. Five. Do you like ice skating, Jen? I've never tried it. Then you have to try it. How about Thursday or Friday night? Thursday night is no good for me. I have a Spanish class. Is Friday night okay? Yes, it's fine. Terrific. You'll love it. Then after we finish, we can get something to eat downtown. Okay. Thanks. Six. Would you like to see a tennis match with me on Sunday afternoon, Stephen? Sunday? What am I doing on Sunday afternoon? That should be okay. I don't think I have any plans. Great. And maybe after the match, we could see a movie? Sounds good. Listening three. One. Aaron, this is David. How are things? I'm calling to see if you want to come over to my place on Friday night. Some friends from school are coming over to watch the soccer game on TV. They'll probably bring pizza to eat while we watch. We plan to meet at my place around seven. Anyway, if you can come, please give me a call. Bye. Two. Hi, Aaron. This is Maria. Sorry I missed you. I wondered if you're free for lunch on Saturday. It's Meg's birthday, and some of us are planning a surprise party for her. We're going to meet at that Japanese restaurant in the mall at 1 p.m. If you can join us, please let me know as soon as you can. Oh, we're buying her a big bunch of flowers, so you don't have to buy anything for her. Okay, I'll call you later. Bye. Three. Hello, Aaron. This is your Aunt Barbara. How's my favorite niece? Listen, honey, I have an extra ticket for the opera on Friday night. I wondered if you'd like to go with me. It's a wonderful Australian singer, a soprano. Doesn't that sound great? I know how you love opera. We could have dinner together before the concert if you like. Anyway, I'll call you tonight to see if you're interested in going. Bye-bye. Four. Hi, Aaron. This is Paul. Some of us are going bowling on Sunday afternoon, and we wondered if you'd like to join us. We'll meet at around 3 p.m. at the Holiday Bowling Lanes. You know, the one we usually go to. We're going to have dinner somewhere afterward, and then see a movie, too. How does that sound? Give me a call if you want to join us. Bye. Listening 3. 1. Aaron, this is David. How are things? I'm calling to see if you want to come over to my place on Friday night. Some friends from school are coming over to watch the soccer game on TV. They'll probably bring pizza to eat while we watch. We plan to meet at my place around 7. Anyway, if you can come, please give me a call. Bye. 2. Hi, Aaron. This is Maria. Sorry I missed you. I wondered if you're free for lunch on Saturday. It's Meg's birthday, and some of us are planning a surprise party for her. We're going to meet at that Japanese restaurant in the mall at 1 p.m. If you can join us, please let me know as soon as you can. Oh, we're buying her a big bunch of flowers, so you don't have to buy anything for her. Okay, I'll call you later. Bye. 3. Hello, Aaron. This is your Aunt Barbara. How's my favorite niece? Listen, honey, I have an extra ticket for the opera on Friday night. I wondered if you'd like to go with me. It's a wonderful Australian singer, a soprano. Doesn't that sound great? I know how you love opera. We could have dinner together before the concert if you like. Anyway, I'll call you tonight to see if you're interested in going. Bye-bye. Four. Hi, Aaron. This is Paul. Some of us are going bowling on Sunday afternoon, and we wondered if you'd like to join us. We'll meet at around 3 p.m. at the Holiday Bowling Lanes. You know, the one we usually go to. We're going to have dinner somewhere afterward, and then see a movie, too. How does that sound? 
Give me a call if you want to join us. Bye. Pronunciation. One. Do you have any plans? Two. Do you want to go? Three. Do you like tennis? Four. Are you sure? Five. Are you free? Six. Are you coming? Dictation. Hey, Jen. Are you free this weekend? Maybe. Do you have some plans? Yes. Do you like pop music? Sure. Why? I've got tickets for the Pop Music Festival at Reed Hall. Do you want to come with me? Do you have tickets for Friday night or Saturday night? Saturday night. Great. I'd love to.